I think anytime you make a move, it's, it's a learning curve for you. Uh, but he's improving uh, there. He's using his hands. He's a very physical player. He's a guy that loves to play the game. So we expect some great things out of him. What, what makes him a candidate for a defensive inspire? What about his makeup, his build, his, all those things? Uh, he just has a, 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 a good body. Uh, he has uh, a passion and desire to play. And, and, you know, playing defensive line in general is about being tough. And, and, and playing hard has a great motor. He has those things. What do you like about uh, what Bruce Gaston is doing for you this year as opposed to where he was at this point as a true freshman last year? He understands the game a lot better. You know, he understands what it takes to play at this level and be successful. Uh, it's not new to him, so he's improving in all areas of his game, uh, you know, against the run and against the pass. Is that going to allow him to, you know, be more disruptive, just knowing what he's doing out there rather than, you know, just uh, relying on instinct? Well, he, he knew what he was doing last year, uh, so uh, it, anytime you have experience, it will help you get better and help you play better. What else are you seeing out of the, the defensive ends right now? You've got a couple banged up, but are, are guys getting enough reps right now? I, I don't think as a coach you're never happy with the amount of practice time you get, but the NCAA says you only have X number of hours. So, uh, But the guys are getting plenty of reps out there, and we're seeing some, some good things out of Gerald Gooden and and uh, uh, Ryan Russell and, and, and all the guys that are playing that position, uh, Ryan Isaac and just a bunch of guys that are doing well and just continuing to improve. Have you got Isaac back now? Uh, he's on his way back. Okay. He's on his way back. We've heard a lot of people just say good things about Gooden and how he's doing during his training camp just to see he looked healthy and pretty good to you too. Uh, absolutely. You know, Gerald looks to be like Gerald, back to his old self. Uh, he seems to be healthy and moving around very well. So we're, Really pleased with him and, and really pleased with the leadership he's providing to the young guys. You know, he's a guy who has the most experience here. Uh, he's a guy we expect him, uh, to have a great season. He's been doing everything that we've asked of him. You said he grew up a little bit this summer from a maturity standpoint. Are you seeing that as well? Do you feel like he's taking on more mature role? Absolutely. Uh, you know, Gerald uh, did one great thing that a lot of people don't get opportunity to do. Gerald has a college degree. Gerald graduated from Purdue University, which is a hell of an honor. And that takes a lot of maturity to do that because a lot of people start things and don't finish them. But Gerald's done a great job there. So that shows his maturity and he's handling things the right way. And he's doing everything we ask him. We're very pleased with what he's doing. You see that translate that out of the field as well? Absolutely.